hi guys you're welcome back to my youtube channel in today's video i'm going to be showing you guys how you can create an okx wallet using your mobile phone it's very easy to do just make sure you follow me to the end of this video to get it all and also if you're new to our youtube channel do where to like subscribe and leave a comment as that will tremendously help grow this channel so guys, without any further ado let's get started so guys now the first step you have to take now is to go over to your play store or your app store if you're using an iphone but i'm using an android device so i'm going to tap on my play store right away so let me tap on my play store to open it so guys now you can see my play store is opening so once your play store opens up what you have to do right away is to tap on the search icon at the bottom right so let me tap on it right away then once it opens up they type in okx so let me type in okx right away okx and you tap on search so let me tap on search so as now you can see the okx logo right there the arrow is pointing at it let me tap on it to open it so guys now you can see right here i've downloaded and installed the okx app into my phone but in case you've not done that what you have to do is to go ahead to install it so guys let me tap on open now to open the okx wallet so i can show you guys how you can create an okx wallet right away so guys you can see now the okx app is opening so like I said, if you have not installed the OKX app, you're going to see a button right there that is written install. All you have to do is to tap on install. Then it will be downloaded and installed into your phone. It's as easy as that. So guys, now you can see my OKX app is opening. So guys, now you can see the OKX app has opened up. So guys, now the next step you have to take now is to tap on where you can see wallet. You can see where this recent wallet there at the top. They have both options there, exchange and wallet. The one you have to tap on is wallet. So let me tap on wallet right away. So guys now the next step you have to take now is to tap on where you can see create wallet but in case you've already created a wallet before now you can tap on the second option where it is written i already have one by tapping on i already have one you'll be able to import your previously created wallet into this app but guys this video is about how to create a new wallet so let me tap on create wallet right away so guys now you can see the next step you can see what's written there seed freeze wallet security portability and control over assets so guys what you have to do now is to tap on where it is written create now so let me tap on create now so guys now you can see what's written here okx wallet wants to use fingerprint recognition so guys if you don't want you to tap on cancel but in case you want to use your fingerprint recognition you tap on enable so guys let me tap on enable right away i want to use my fingerprint you can see what's written here verify your fingerprints so let me place my fingerprint on my fingerprint sensor at the back of my phone so guys now you can see what's written there creating wallets so let's just wait a few seconds wow guys can i see we've been able now to create our wallet you can see what's written at the top wallet a account one you can see our wallet balance so guys now the next important step you need to take now is actually to back up your wallet you can see what's written down there back up your wallet so i'm going to be showing you guys how you can back up your wallet this is for the safety of your wallet and your phones so guys now you can actually back up your wallet using these two options you can either do it using your google drive or you can do manual backup so guys the one i'm going to go for is the second option which is manual backup so let me tap on manual backup right away so guys now you can see what's written there at the top why should i back up your wallet is a decentralized wallet that doesn't store your seed phrases keep them safe and only to yourself they can be used by anyone to assess your wallet and assets so as i can see in the next few steps we're going to be getting our seed phrase which is also called our recovery phrase so we ought to keep this our seed phrase in a safe place because anyone who gets access or gets in touch with this our seed phrase will get access to our wallet and the phones inside our wallet so guys we have to keep it in a safe place so let me tap on continue right away So guys can see the next step this is caution one out of the three caution we're going to be seeing you can see what's written there it said make sure your screen is only visible to you if your seed phrases are captured by screenshots or recording you may lose control of your wallet so that's what you have to do next to tap on i understand so let me tap on i understand so guys here's the caution two out of the three you can see what's written there store your seed phrases offline do not share your seed phrases with anyone or save it in the cloud as they can be easily compromised so guys now what you have to do is to tap on i understand let me tap on it so guys can see the third question which is the last question out of the three let me get to read it they said own the seed phrase own the wallet anyone with access to your seed phrases can get a hold of your wallet and steal your assets so guys this is very important the seed phrase we're going to be getting in the next few seconds make sure you write it somewhere and keep it somewhere safe so guys let me tap on backup seed phrase let me tap on it right away 
then let me use my fingerprints remember i enabled my fingerprints earlier on so guys now you can see what's written there at the top write down seed phrase write down the words in the sequence below and keep them safe don't share with anyone or you may permanently lose your assets so guys now what you have to do now in order to see your seed phrase is to tap on that eye icon right there you can see what's written there they said tap to show seed phrase make sure no one is looking at your screen so guys now by tapping on that icon there where the arrow is pointing i'll be able to see my seed phrase so guys now let me go ahead now to tap it so guys now i've seen my seed phrase there are actually 12 words 12 words so i'm going to be writing them according to the numbers like number one number two i'm going to arrange them in the sequence from number one to number 12 make sure you don't mix them up guys i blurred my seed phrase because this is a very important security information i don't need to put it out there for the public so guys now what i have to do now is to write it down so let me go ahead now to write it down sorry guys just give me a few minutes so i'm going to write this down correctly so guys i've written it down so let me tap on continue so guys now you can see the next step confirm seed phrase so guys they have given us a list of words right here they're asking us to confirm word 2 word 10 and word 11. remember our seed phrase contains 12 words so they're asking us to actually select the word 2 word 10 and word 11. so we have to confirm that this is to make sure that we've actually written down or jotted down our seed phrase somewhere so guys let me go ahead now to select word 2 let me select word 2 right away so guys now you can see i've selected word 2 so let me select word 10. so guys now you can see i've selected word 10 so let me go ahead now to select the word 11 which is the 11th one word 11. so guys now you can see i've selected word 2 word 10 and word 11. so what i have to do next is to tap on done so let me tap on done down there so let me tap on it so guys now you can see wallet backed up so guys now by doing this now we've been able now to create our okx wallet and also we've been able now to back up our wallet manually by copying our seed phrase so guys i've come to the end of this video and i believe you got value from this video if you did do it to like subscribe and leave a comment and also if you're new to our youtube channel do it to hit the bell notification so that whenever i release a new video like this one you're gonna get notified see you in the next upload bye bye peace